Hi everyone, it's Lumi Missy here, and today I have a very exciting tutorial for you guys. And um, it is a bracelet that I've made up myself, and it is a variation of the triple, the tri single, sorry. And you'll find out why it is a variation in a minute, in a second even. So on this side, you have got um, these like two like single chains that look like they've been joined up together. But on this side, it looks like it is a single chain with double bands. Yes, double bands, as you can see, double bands. So um, this is a bracelet which I've made up myself as so far as I know. So I'm going to be teaching you how to make it. And before I start, I just want to show you something that I made. It's a macaron! Yay! This took me an hour and a half. And I think it is worth it because I love it. And yes, I use the same colored bands here and on here. So now let's get to the supplies needed. So today you will need your loom, your hook, an S-clip or C-clip, and 58 bands in the colors of your choice. Um, each link contains two rubber bands except from the starting ones and um, I did 30 links so if you do 30 times 2 which is 60 then minus 2 for these ones which is 58 so 58 bands and I'm using white bands and glittery bands. Now without further ado let's get started. So today I am using the, oops, the bottom three pins so these three and you might want to use those three too because that is how we're going to make this bracelet. So to get started you're going to place a band in a triangle position and then you're going to twist all the bands. So get it off onto your hook, twist it, Oops. Oops, one minute. So when you finally get it over, you should have something like this. And you can push your bands down. Sorry, I'm talking quite loud right now because there is talking downstairs. And, oh my gosh, shut up, people downstairs, sorry. And what I did is just put on, sorry, there's a lot of talking downstairs. And now you're just talking over all of the bottom bands. like that and I'm sorry about all the talking downstairs now you're putting on your double band so one there and one there and then you are hooking over all the bands so now you just turn it to the side and then hook hooking over those two bands there and then hooking over that single band there. And that is basically what you do for this whole bracelet. So I'm just going to show you a few more times. And then I'm going to go off camera and finish this. Now putting on my next layer. Like that. So you should have something like this on your loom right now. And I'm now going to go off camera and finish this. Right, so I've now finished my whole bracelet. And once you have gotten to this part, you need to take one last single rubber band and put it on all of them like we did at the beginning. And now hook over all of oops, the bottom bands. And then hook over the hardest bands of all. Um... This is really hard to do on camera. Sorry about that, guys. I've done most of this off camera, but um, the hooking process is really easy, except from this pin here. It is a little bit hard to do on camera, um, but 
overall I did um, about 29 lengths but on um, this one I did 30 lengths so now to take it off your loom you're gonna get this band here hook it on to there push your bands down and then this one here hook it on to that pin there and once you have done that, you're going to take your S clip or your C clip and secure it onto all of those bands on there so that it does not come undone. And you can take it off of your loom and then secure it together with the other end there. Like that, and you have finished your bracelet. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to make a um, tri-single variation on your loom and give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, um, follow me on all my social media sites linked in the description box below and um, credit to Tutorials by A for, um, I think she created the tri-single bracelet so I don't know but credit to her anyway if she did and go out, go check out our macaron um charm and um i hope you enjoyed this video and yeah comment your requests below and i hope to see you again next time bye